Hello everyone, this is me, Savia here, and I'm back with another bonus read, which is going to be for whoever needs it. Even though it's a general reading, but this reading is going to have a special message for you because the messages that we're going to tap into today in this reading are coming directly from your soul to you. So be open and receptive to receive signs and messages coming from your soul so you could know what you need to know right now. So yes, yeah, stick around and before I dive into the read, let me remind you it's a general reading. It may, it may not resonate with everyone and all right now in the given circumstances, but it will definitely have something to offer to you in terms of an advance maybe about something that is going to happen. So stick around and uh, if you're willing to purchase personal reads, uh, you can check the description box for that and let's see what is the message? What is it that you really, really, really need to know right now? What is it? What is it? What is the message for you that you need to know right now, that you need to understand right now? What is it that your soul wants you to know? What is it? What is it? Am I clear on what my soul reality wants? A soul really wants. Now, this is your soul's message. And I feel like your soul really wants you to look deeper into it. So you would know what your soul is craving for. Probably like, you know, you are just not listening to your soul right now. It's time for you to listen to it clearly. Have some time spent in your, um, your room with yourself or in the nature uh, with yourself. I feel like, you know, there is something that you deeply want to do, but you're not listening to your soul right now. Whether it's about a relationship, whether it's about a person, whether it's about a job, whether it's about something else, but there is something that you need to listen to right now. And your soul really wants you to understand it clearly because i feel like you know there is something that you're probably running away from or hiding away from accepting as a fact but yes divine really wants you to know one thing that your soul has a message for you and it really wants you to know that clearly that you know there is something that it wants and you're ignoring it right now let's see what it says take out the shoulds and the limitations get out of your head and pay attention to your heart's desires instead if you knew it was impossible to fail, what would you do? Where you go, go with all your heart. Now, it's very it's it's very important for you to know one thing. Maybe there are some things that you want to do, but you're letting your fears kind of dictate your actions and behaviors. You got to stop doing that because this is what your soul really wants you to. You know, if you're having a thought or if you're having an idea or if you want to pursue a dream, job relationship situation but you are thinking like maybe it's impossible maybe i should not do this your shoulds and could not be or you know all those things that you're having and stopping yourself now your soul really wants you to get them out of the way and go ahead with whatever your soul is asking you to go for your that's your soul's craving and your soul wants you to do that so go ahead now today's soul action that you can do is Ask yourself, what is it that your soul really wants and what does your heart crave for? Then take step, one step in that direction. So have some time spent with yourself and listen to your soul right now because there is a lot of abundance if you follow your soul or your intuitive uh, nature or your divine nature by default. Because I feel like, you know, for the majority of us, we always kind of like, you know, tend to kind of overpass uh, overshadows the importance of uh, listening to our soul or listening to our divine intuition. I feel like you know, there is something that you're missing out on right now. And if you could listen to your soul, you would be putting yourself on the right path forward. So go ahead, do that. Let's move on to the next one. Who can I serve today? Your soul, I feel like you know, for those of you who are seeing feathers, um, there is something that divine has been trying to communicate to you. So if that has been happening to you lately, know that these messages are definitely for you and your soul is wanting you to communicate to you through me with these messages. Who can I serve today? In a world lacking soul to soul connection, small and simple acts are what create the biggest and most lasting impact. We shift our pain and experience on avalanche of love when we lose ourselves in the service of others. Who needs you today? So there is something that you can do to help someone out there who is in need and divine really wants you to be open to help someone out there. You know, it doesn't have to be something big, but yes, 
do help someone. It is going to do a tremendous amount of things for you without you even noticing it. It is going to help you release the blocks. It is going to help you release the mental, physical, emotional, uh, you know, uh, self-imposed blocks. It is also going to remove the physical blocks that are coming and stumbling, that you're stumbling upon one after another. So do that. Listen to your soul. Do some act of kindness. Do help, do help someone out there who needs your help. Um, if you think that there's nobody that you can help to, um, go out, do some act of kindness and generosity. Show some act of, uh, you know, gen you know, generosity or kindness. So do some donations at that. That can make you feel like you helped someone. So do something like that. Now, today's soul action that you can take is listen to your heart. Who needs you? Make one soulful connection today and give solely to spread more love, expecting nothing in return. Notice the joy that you feel when you serve others. Now, it's very important. Like, you know, even if there is nobody who's asking for help, spending some time and giving them lots of love and your time and your care and your attention can also be like a blessing these days because people have become so busy, so occupied with so much happening. They don't have enough time for their loved ones even. So maybe you can visit a friend that you haven't met for years or for months and now you can take that time out and spend some time with that person. Maybe it's a soul message that that person needs you right now. So take it as a sign and go ahead, do that. So that is also going to help you um, get on the right path for yourself because your soul really wants you to know these messages. Am I getting enough rest to restore my energy and fully show up to my life? You might have been doing a lot of things lately to, to achieve career goals, to achieve something in love, to do something for the others, for family, for this, for that. Have you been taking time for yourself out from all the worldly pressures i guess no that's why this passage has shown up you are the asset this body is your vehicle notice how your body is feeling how much sleep you are getting and what you can do to help your body rest so do something to take care of your body to take care of yourself right now um i feel like you know we might have been ignoring your signs and messages coming from your body as well lately listen to your body and do something to to make it feel better to love it to to pamper it to nourish it do something good for your body get into healthy eating get into healthy act of uh, you know or lifestyle right now that is very much needed so today's sole action that you can take uh, is take a bath put on some lavender essential oil and go to bed ridiculously early or give yourself a time out today notice your body thanking you today's mantra the more i give myself permission to rest the more i can contribute so it's very important right now for you to take some time out for yourself for your soul and do the things that we have talked about here in this reading i really love these kind of readings because they do um they do have an impact on our lives that we probably don't give you know much of uh, you know importance to like you know it's it's something which you need to do right now and probably you have been kind of like you know putting on the side oh we will do that later on but no it's time it's high time that you listen to your soul and nourish it because that's where your all the other plans will start nourishing too so yeah that's pretty much it coming up for you for this read if it was of help do like share and subscribe till i do the next read take care bye